The officials are set. The players are set. Ray Ferraro between the benches is set. I'm James Cebulski. Let's go. They've dropped the puck here in the third, and it's been a blowout thus far. Let's see if there's any sort of response. We've got 40 minutes in the books. Ray Ferraro is between the benches. Ray, how do you see things playing out? Los Angeles doesn't need the score any more goals. They've got a comfortable lead. They're in the position where they can't give away anything. Don't let your opponent climb back in this. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. You can feel the air coming out of the bench here. Down a bunch, and now they take a penalty. Here's a first look at the power play. Key for any team on the power play is to get control of the puck first. So we'll look at the faceoff, and this power play at the very least has to generate a little momentum. It's their first crack at it tonight. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Jones is just one of the team picture tonight. There's not anybody across the board that can look in the mirror and say they've done a good job. Deneau's ready to take the draw here on this power play. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Puck goes out of play. We got a faceoff coming up. Kadri's certainly in a confident state here. His point streak's extending, and he wants to keep it going. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Los Angeles has been impressive tonight. What can you say? 4-1 is where we sit. The Avs will go to work here in the offensive zone. Oh, and that goes off target. I mean, he works into position to, to get this spot on the ice. It's a good scoring spot, but he misses the net. He's got to at least test the goalie. Tosses it to Gerard. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right oh. side. Sorry, James. That's a really solid hit there. LA's got the puck against the boards. Centering pass off the pipe. Jones gets on top of the puck, and we'll get a whistle. Everybody on the ice is gassed. He's probably gassed, too. Now you can get a drink of water and reset. Kopitar is at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. That's one way to take possession with both centers tied up there in that scrum. And the puck's booted away. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. Centering feed! Can't connect the play. There's the whistle, and here's the call. In the moment, you think it's the right play, but you reach out, you grab the opponent, and you get called as soon as your hand grabs on. Well, things open up for both sides a little bit here with some four-on-four -four action. I think the best strategy is to be aggressive on the four-on-four. -on -four. Don't wait for the other guys to make a mistake. Quick feed to Taves. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now on the man advantage. Nice feed. Denies him! Colorado's on the attack. Picked up along the wall by Deneau. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Great defensive effort with the stick. Looking to break out here on the power play. And the extended stick ends that one. Colorado's got it along the wall. The Kings have it now. going to play the puck from behind the cage. Slides it across to Nichuskin. The Avs played along the boards. Denies him in front. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Feeds the puck to Dowdy. Deneau's picking up steam. Along the half wall with the puck. Poked away by Nichuskin. Bank pass feed. Here's a short pass to Kempe. Rocked him in the open ice. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Rantanen. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a chance. Quick's got it. And he'll let 
for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The Kings are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. And they continue to apply pressure here. Looks to get the puck over to Mata. And now he angles it across to Malardi. Los Angeles has it against the half wall. Monster blocker stopped by Jones. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck. So the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Los Angeles has it in their own zone. Here they come up along the wing. And that pass doesn't go. From off the wall and onto a stick. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Angles it over to Moore. Nice pass. Grunstrom's trying to increase the lead here. Not that they need it. It's their way ahead. Jones freezes the puck and opts for the whistle. Nashville's on the calendar next. That should be a fun one. It should be. The teams play generally pretty aggressive physical games against each other. Past the midway mark in this period. Los Angeles is playing on another level tonight. They lead it 4-1. And he comes up with a stop there. Jones opts to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit. You need your goalie to help you out. Officials have got both teams ready. And it looks like play is set to resume here. Colorado's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And now it's over to Drouin. Some good stick work to force that turnover. Fires it into the offensive zone. Colorado's looking to break out. They gain the zone from the left side. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Puck grabbed by Sturm. Sends it in deep. Colorado's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Kadri. The Kings gain possession in their own end. Poked away at center by Nachuskin. And now he moves it quickly to Moore. The Avalanche have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Picked off by White Cloud. The Kings have played an outstanding game. What stood out for me is when they don't have the puck, they get it back really quickly. It's been that way all night. Makar is taking it from his own end. Quick pass to Nichuskin. Explores his options behind the net. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Colorado's got it across the line. Cuts to the front. Routine save made by Cook. LA's got possession of the puck. Feeds it to Toffoli. Moves the puck up to Rantanen. Moves it to Makar. Back to the point it goes. Puck picked up by Tuck. Dishes it to Anderson. L.A. is moving it up the ice. And he slides it quickly to Kempe. Slides the puck over. Return pass. Los Angeles takes possession along the wall. Redirected off a stick. Makes it look easy with the stop. Just here in the late stages of this frame, and it's been a pretty one-sided affair to this point. It's 4-1. Los Angeles takes possession off the draw. Here's a shot, and he makes the save. The Avalanche have possession along the boards. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. LA's got control of it now from their own end. Slides the puck across to Mata. Quick feed to Lazat. And he takes the dish. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. 
Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. The Kings win it. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Let's the wrister go. Oh, what a save with the glove. That was almost as flashy as my suit tonight. Goalies love making the glove save, whether it's a great save or a rather run-of-the-mill one. They love to show you that they've caught it after they've put it away. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Takes the feed. And now he moves it to Taves and tries to make a diagonal pass to Velarde. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Here's a short pass to Drouin. That's gloved by Quick. Colorado's won the faceoff. Gets in the lane with the body. Five fields into the offensive zone now on the attack. Can't connect. And there's the final horn, putting a bow on this one here this evening. L.A.'s winning ways are showing no end here, Ray. No, they're not, James. I mean, I, I love the way they're playing, and when you watch them play, it seems like they're going to win all the time. They have total belief in their team. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.